All right, guys, what's up? Back here with Jaden Dalton Outdoors. And today, uh, I'm going to be doing a two-week chicken update. Yesterday was two weeks since our chicken massacre, if you will. Y'all probably saw that video on my channel already. Something we don't exactly know what it was came, got four of our chickens. So today, we're get, just going to show y'all an update on the ones that got hurt, how they're doing, uh, and that kind of stuff. They are doing a whole lot better, uh, so y'all can check them out right here. Okay, so now I'm outside. I don't uh, know exactly where they are. The bigger ones, none of them really got disturbed except for the two that the uh, whatever took them took. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and see if I can call the other ones out, get them to come running out here. And I'll try to catch the two that were injured, show y'all how they're doing better. So watch this. I have a little method how I can get them to come out. Okay, guys, so I did find them. They're right there under that building. Let me see if I can't get them to run towards me. Woo, chicken. See, we make that noise and we're gonna give them some treats, so watch. Come here, come here. Okay, so I got this one to come up. It's one of the ones that are injured, but it's still a little sketched out. So I'm gonna try to catch it. Nope. She said, I'm gone. All right, I'm going to try to get her to come back. All right, guys, I'm going to set y'all up right here. See if I can't get them to come to that black thing right there. I'll put y'all on time lapse. Time lapse. Let's see how long it takes them. Got it. Alrighty, so we got it. This is one of the ones that were injured. It's actually one of our nicest, but right now she's a little disgruntled, aren't you? Alright, so I'll show y'all uh, where she was injured and how she's healed up here in a minute. Alright guys, so here she is. So, uh, if y'all saw in my video where they did get attacked, she had a torn up spot like right there on her nose right beside her comb. Well, that healed up pretty good. I think, let me see, I think there still is a little spot, a few little spots where there's like scabs and stuff, but she's still fine. She was real lazy for the first few days. Now she's back out scratching around. As y'all saw, she was uh, some of the first to run up to me, one of the first, uh, let me say, to run up to me. So I'm gonna go try to catch Gravy, the rooster. He loves to balsa all his hens around and stuff. I'm gonna go try to catch him. She was trying to peck. There's an ant on my hand right there. She was trying to peck that. Here, eat it, eat it. Oh, well, she won't eat it. But yeah, I'm gonna try to catch Gravy. He's the uh, one who had the big wound in his side. He's not wanting to come right now. I'm gonna have to go try to get a different method. Okay, so I went inside trying to find some stuff uh, to um get the chickens. Mom gave me this bowl of veggies and stuff, uh, skins to different vegetables to give to them, and I got that tortilla. I know it's uh, not the greatest for chicks always to be eating bread and chickens, but right now it's an exception. We gotta get these things. But the ones over there in the pen, are freaking out, trying to get out there. The bigger ones, we uh, um, have put them together. They go in at night with each other, but they just don't like to hang out with each other in the pen. They fight, so we usually let the smaller ones out. We will let the bigger ones out a lot also, but I just decided not to today. They're freaking out, wanting some of this also, so I'm gonna go give them some first. All right, all right y'all want some food, don't y'all? There y'all go. You hear the rooster making those noises? He actually does that to tell the hens that there's food. 
and he'll act like he's pecking it when he's not. He'll wait for him to come up and get it. That right there is the rooster. His name is Mike Tyson. It's a little bantam. Well, I'm going to just go ahead and get all these in there so they can start eating on them. Okay, so now I've been throwing them the bread, and then here comes Gravy right there. And he said he can't mess out on any bread. Look at them all run for this. Watch. They are fed, just so y'all know. They just love treats. I don't want y'all to think that they're all running for it like that because they never get food. We do feed them. There you go. Get you some, Gravy. Oh, I'm going to try to catch him. Guys, I set y'all up. There's gravy right there. I'm gonna go grab the bread, see if I can't get them to come up to me so I can catch them. All right, guys, so it's like way later, several hours later. We went shopping and some stuff, but we came back. We caught gravy, which is what I was wanting to show y'all. Well, well, then the other one who was uh, um, injured, he is panting right now. They'll do that when they're thirsty or hot. It is very hot out here. So that's a little fun fact. Chickens do pant like dogs. But, so I don't know if y'all saw in the other um, video where his wing was, but that wing, I believe it was this one, you all, it looked like this. So I was getting mixed up with the wings, but now it looked like that. Now that's how it looks. Now if you pull back these feathers, you can still see it's a little scabbed over and stuff. But he healed up real quick. Doesn't look uh, bad uh, um, anymore at all. And now he's fine. He's back crowing, trying to fight us. Uh, bossing around his hands and scratching. He's uh, growing a whole lot also. He's very big and now. But we're going to let him go since he's thirsty. But I figured I'd let y'all see him two weeks later from when he got attacked. Him and the other one. So that's how they look now. Alright guys, hopefully y'all liked this video. If so, smash that like button. And leave a comment down below on what you think about these chickens. And uh, give me some video ideas, and I will try to fulfill them, whatever you tell me to do, as long as it's uh, I can. Uh, so, yeah, do that. Make sure to subscribe, and as always, chickens!